What is going on YouTube? Foxy Girl, welcome to you guys today with a brand new video and in today's video we are going to be looking at every single woodland camo in Call of Duty. So I hope you guys do enjoy. If you guys do, make sure... Oh shit. If you guys do, make sure you guys leave a like down below, subscribe, turn on notifications. Use code FOXY on gfield.com for 10% off your order. And without further ado, let's go, bros. Alrighty, now this is probably a hacked lobby, but this is the woodland camo in Call of Duty 4. First ever woodland camo in Call of Duty history, so. Alright, let's see here. Hopefully we can get at least like a couple kills, I'm hoping. I just want a couple kills. I don't want anything crazy. Alright, there's one. There's another. I, okay, never mind. There's not a. Okay, I thought there was a guy in there, but never mind. Oh, one burst, one burst wonder. I don't know if this is a hack lobby or not. It kind of looks like it. Why is why is there so many people? Yeah, there's a bunch of people on our team. There's like more people than there should be on our team. That's awesome. Hell yeah, COD 4. Oh, uh, so they're on there. Now we got UAV. Oh, okay. Alrighty, well, yeah, so this is the first Call of Duty game that brought in camos, actually. It's pretty crazy to think about that because now they're, like, such a staple, and I just died because I was changing, like, changing the position of my- What the fuck? I was changing the position of my microphone, and I died because of that. That's awesome. It's all good, though. This- this is a hack lobby, or a modded lobby, whatever you want to call it. Mods, hacks, whatever. Okay, they, yeah, the spawns are fucking great in this game. I imagine they'll probably shift over to, like, over here or something. Or, like, I'll run past here and then they'll end up spawning behind me. There's a guy right there. Nice. Yeah, we're using the M16. I, I, I just wanted to use a weapon that I had this camo for. And, ironically enough, it is the M16 that I do have this camo for. Uh, this gun. And these kids are just getting pooped on, actually. They're, they're just getting pooped on. Man, COD 4, man. The original Call of Duty 4. It's crazy. Whoa. Um, okay. Okay, yeah. You just got pooped on. Dude, stop flipping the spawn! Alright, so we got the Woodland Camo in Modern Warfare 2. And this game is my favorite Call of Duty, for those of you that are new to the channel and things like that. This this Call of Duty is my favorite. Alright, so why do I have, like, a bunch of fucking uh, different outfits on in this video? So, if you guys don't know, Modern Warfare 2 is really hard to find games in. I don't know why. Ever since it went backwards compatible, the game is just super hard to find games. I don't know why. Ever since it went backwards compatible, Modern Warfare 2 has been terrible uh, with finding lobbies, especially with like a decent ping. And I don't know, it's just, you can't find games anymore. I don't know. I don't know if it's just like the player base has gone down or if it's the location of where people are playing at and I can't connect to them. But it sucks now. It sucks and I can't really find games. So I was trying to pick a good time to play this game and it's the weekend now it's saturday the day that this video comes out and it's around like noon so i figured people would be playing around this time and i've just been like really consumed in projects for school and things like that too so this is the second woodland camo in call of duty history oh, this is on modern warfare 2 obviously like i just said and uh modern warfare 2 is my favorite call of duty so i'm pretty biased towards this game i love it so much i had so much fun on it when i was like growing up and I just got fucking destroyed. Heck, and I'm sucking balls. Guys, let me know down in the comments, what's your favorite Call of Duty? Mine is this one, but I guess a close second would be, hmm, Black Ops 1. Black Ops 1, definitely. Which is the next Call of Duty game we'll be going into for Woodland Camo. Alrighty. The next game is Call of Booty. Black Ops 1, my favorite Call of Duty Black Ops game. And we have the Galil here, and we have Woodland Camo on the Galil. Uh, this sensitivity is really high. This last time I played this when I was sniping? Yeah, that, that's a really high sense. Okay. Okay, well, we spawned over here. Now we have enemy counter UAVs coming in out the ass. That's awesome. Hell yeah. I love that. Is anyone coming over here? I really like this Woodland Camo, honestly. This one looks really cool. It's got a little bit more of a greenish vibe, you know? It's a little bit different. It's not just, you know, Woodland like we know. They actually made something different out of it. Okay, no. Oh my god, we got the double kill. Nice. Is that a chopper? Pretty sure it is. Man, I, I miss maps like this where we could set something off. Like a, like a, oh my god, dude. Look, look at the rocket ship. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it go. Hell yeah. God, I'm, I'm, I'm so, I'm so bad. There we go, there's one. Hold on. There's a guy back there. Oh, he's to my right. Dude, what the fuck is wrong with me? Is that a guy? Okay, well. Alright, we got an assist for it. Shit. No! Oh my goodness. <laughs> Black Ops 1 is my favorite Black Ops because... I guess, I guess it's because we played it in its prime. And it was just a ton of fun to play at the time. We just, it was this and MW2, I believe. 
Oh, that's a double. Nice. And Black Ops 1, I also like the gunplay and the variety and the maps in Black Ops 1 as well. No offense to Black Ops 2 because Black Ops 2 has some great guns and some great maps. But Black Ops 1 for me is just... its I guess this is the game where I'm a little bit biased towards my high school years and just playing it in its prime. I guess that's kind of why I prefer it. Also, I'm pretty biased towards it because the M... Uh, not the M4, the, the Commando, basically the M4 of this game, is not featured in any other Call of Duty. I mean, I know it's basically the M4 Carbine, but the Commando has never made its return into a Black Ops game, unlike, you know, the Galil or the M8A1, aka M8A7 in Black Ops 3, you know. The, those guns have all made their return, whereas the Commando just, it just hasn't made its return yet, and I'm just waiting. All right. We're on Call of Booty Ghosts. And the way the camos worked in Ghost was a little bit different. In Ghost, you could just do individual challenges and you didn't have to unlock the camos in an order. You could just unlock them however uh, or whichever order you wanted. And for the Woodland camo in Ghosts, you had to get 15 kills immediately after sliding. And then you got the Woodland camo, which is super cool. And people are... Uh, you know, I just said this to Dismo. I said, the maps in Ghosts are way too uh, realistic. They're too realistic. And what do I mean by they're too realistic? I mean that there's so many pieces of cover. There's so many broken little details there's so many uh, for example in the, that one map that's got all the trees in it or like that you're in the jungle it's too realistic to the point where everyone can kind of sit it in a corner and camp and things like that that's why this game is so campy because it's too realistic the maps are too realistic and there's so many pieces of cover to hide behind it's one thing to have you know one or two pieces of cover you know outside or maybe you know a couple pieces of cover outside that's one thing but to have so many pieces of cover in so many spots of the map, it's way too much. Fucking IEDs, man. No, what the fuck? Nope. Bro, like, look at this shit, bro. You guys can't tell i'm not really a big fan of ghosts at least for the most part i feel like ghost could have been like such a good game but snd is pretty good in ghost but just the regular gameplay of ghost is just i don't know the hit detection is fucking amazing it's the best in any call of duty and i will stand by that till the day i die as much as i dislike this game the hit detection is spot on there we go we're using the remington because this is the gun i figured i would pick for this camo. I was gonna pick the vector, but then I was just like, you know what? If we get on really big maps, I don't want to be stuck using a really, uh, hey, there's a guy right there. I didn't want to be stuck using an SMG on, like, a really big map if we end up getting on, like, a big map, so. No, you're dead. Oh my god, I don't know how I got the kill. A few moments later. No, it was sitting over there. See, you see how everyone blends in? And how there's so much realism, like, there's plants in certain places that would always have a plant, or something like that. Like, uh, the, you guys understand what I'm saying? When I say that there's so much realistic, uh, just so much realism in these maps, there are some cases where there should be realism. And then there should be other instances where there shouldn't be realism. Ghost isn't a great example of a map and Call of Duty being a little bit too realistic as far as maps go. The attention to detail in this game it's just incre it's incredible like don't get me wrong like each map looks really nice i don't think that the maps look bad but it looks i don't want to say it looks too good because like that people will think well that doesn't make any sense if you understand what i'm saying the maps are just too realistic all righty now as you guys can see i, I i'm gonna have uh, switching shirts. I'm gonna be switching outfits in this video because um I had to unlock Woodland Camo in this vid in this uh, game first. I didn't un I didn't have it unlocked because I didn't play AW in its prime. So I just figured, yeah, why not? Just let's just take our time on the video and I'll unlock it myself. So what I did was I got 80 hip fire kills in order to get this Woodland Camo, and it's pretty underwhelming, but whatever. It's all good. It's all good. I'm not really worried about it. Um, I'm getting shit on, you know, left and right. But yeah, this is the Advanced Warfare Woodland Camo. It's okay. I've been doing okay on AW. Haven't been, you know, completely pooping on kids, but I haven't been shit in the bed either, so, you know. Okay, so there was a guy in there. Hi. We're using the ASM-1 because I 
wanted to get the 80 hip fire kills instead of getting like 80 long shot kills and my aim sucks ass disregard that with the smgs in this game you have to get 80 hip fire kills and then in, with the ars you have to get i think it's um like 80 long shot kills and i tried doing the long shots already and i was trying to use the what, what's it called the, the ball 27 whatever the bal whatever the hell you want to call it and I just wasn't about it. I wasn't about trying to get long shots like a bunch and shit. Damn, he just got blown the fuck up. <laughs> yeah, this woodland camo kind of sucks. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not even gonna front. Some of the camos in this game, or I'd say a decent amount, they kind of suck balls. Not even gonna lie. Like, even the diamond camo is, is pretty bad in this game. And I'm just terrible. Bruh. I mean, my skills are some ass, but like... I don't know, like, I just feel like the cameras in this game, they just aren't that good. I'm terrible. I'm playing like shit right now. Now, finally, we have the woodland camo in call of duty modern warfare remastered and this is the remastered version of call of duty 4 so i think it's it's it's, it's just right to show the original woodland camo and then show this camo as well so oh man modern warfare remastered if you guys didn't check out the latest video on mwr make sure you guys go do so i was playing with some IRL friends and all that good stuff we had a great time it was, it was a lot of fun it was some good editing in there as well so i'll leave that in the description below make sure you guys go check that out we are using the g36c and this gun is freaking sweet i love the g36c i also got some uh, trash talkers in this game like yesterday i think and i just got pooped on by a shotgun but if you guys want to see that video or if you guys want to see that footage let me know down in the comments there bros that i'll edit that video up real nice and juicy nope get away from me with your shotgun looking ass bro ah. that's not no let's see what are we doing Lovely. Shoot me out of everybody. And they have a hella chopped up. Lovely. Later. Dude, even these guys are sitting in corners and shit. Just like hiding. I don't like that, bro. Oh my god. I don't know how I didn't die just there, but okay. Well, I'm gonna die now. No, I'm not, because he, he's a shitter. <laughs> Alright, well, at least we got an airstrike. I was, um, I was like, what the fuck? But yeah, all right, let's try and get that in. Hopefully we can get a little bit more. And of course, no one's in there now. What the fuck? No kills? You serious, bro? Get turned on. Double kills. Two. Someone watch my back. Oh, oh, look, there's this guy. Oh, man, he's got pwned, bro. What are you doing? I say, that would suck if I died. What are you doing there, bud? Oh no, someone just took my kill, bro. Stop camping! My goodness. Holy shnikes. No! Oh, dude, I destroyed a claymore. Hold on. Ah, we got a hella job to me. He's got murdered him! No! I had to camp my nuts off a little bit in order to get that, but, uh, yeah. Guys, I hope y'all did enjoy this video. If you guys did, make sure you guys leave a like down below. Subscribe, turn on notifications. What camo would you guys like me to do next? Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.